What's up guys, in here we've got the brand new WWE Attitude Era Women's Championship belt. Uh, this is brand new on the WWE shop, I ordered it this week and it's arrived today. So I'm super excited to unbox it, we're going to check it out and also compare it to the old like Fix Inc 2001 version of this belt. Um, so yeah, let, let's get in. Yes. Okay, so like first impressions on it, the thickness of the plates is awesome. Having the old version of the belt and like comparing the two, like there's no comparison. Like this is so cool and I'm so like pleased that they redid this one. Like I heard like rumors that they were gonna re-release some of the like Attitude Era championships. Um, but I always thought, like when you think of the ones that are kind of the, the hardest to find, it's like the, the classic tag titles um, and things like that. So I, I don't know whether there's like a, an issue with who designed those and why they can't re-release those yet and why they've gone for this one. But the, the WWE version of the Women's Championship is, is pretty hard to find, uh, especially in Good Nick. Like, but this is just sick. Like, look how thick. Look at the thickness. Like, can you see, like, and like the, the the detail on the strap. Okay, so I want to compare it. So, so this is the the brand new WWE version. This one is the WWF version. So this one was like two thousand and one. Go. Like this one is so much more detailed. Oh, I've got a mark on the back of it. You see that? Well, that's not very good, is it? Either way, I don't really care. I don't really know what to say. Like. So this is like the thickness of the plates in, in the original one. I don't even know if you can see, like, like there's no like, like that's it. So like sitting down and having a look at both of them, obviously the new one is way better than, than the old one. Like the, the detail on this new one, especially on the strap, so much better than this one. Like I can't even like go into it. The one thing that I do prefer in the old one compared to the new one is the backing. Um, so I think this one has gone like with like the croc backing and this one's more like the snakeskin one. Um, I think this one looks cooler, but either way, I guess the front of the new one like makes up so much better than this old one. I don't know. My champ when I was a kid was China, so this belt just reminds me of China. Um, I'm so pleased that they, they remade this one. In my old video I said I would recommend to wait for a sale on the WWE shop before you buy a replica belt because they're kind of really, really expensive, but I didn't wait for a sale for this one. 
Sorry, I couldn't wait. I needed it when I saw it went up. Um, also, there's not much of a curve in the plate. I don't know if you can kind of see that. That's kind of all we've got. Whereas this one, to be fair, this one is kind of, I bought this off eBay, so this is kind of like mashed up. Um, there's a lot of curve in this plate. A lot of curve. The whole thing is just, I thought this one was kind of cool because it was kind of beat up and stuff, but like now comparing it to like a brand new one that is actually looks the shit. Um, I think maybe I'll get my old one re-leathered or something to try and make it a little bit cooler. I don't know. This is my new favorite belt though. Oh, it is so sick. What do you reckon? Which one looks better? It's obviously this one. It doesn't even need to ask. This one's way better. I don't really have a lot more to say. I think the detail on the strap is awesome. I guess maybe the etching could be a little bit more. I don't know. I'm not a belt expert. I just collect the ones that I like the look of and that have good memories. Oh, what do I do with this one? Like this one compared to this one now is just like, even the weight difference between the two. I'm so pleased with this. This is sick. 